what's up, man? He's joking. Yeah, man. Um, these days, this video about ransom video, psyching not ransom video. Just coming at this another fucking, another fucking, this is about another freaking Patriots, man. Yo, man, I had to get that in my mind with Patriots, man. Really, I think Baltimore can stop Patriots off from Tom Brady. Why? Tom Brady played against a defense, played against a defense that wasn't all that good. That allowed a lot of points a game. They ain't, any Bron Broncos allowed a lot of points versus this. Middle Broncos versus face the um, they face the um Buffalo. Buffalo had like four, on like forty something, forty something points in them. Buffalo scored so much points in them too, and Buffalo is not all that good team. And Buffalo scored a lot of points on the Patriots too. So I can't say that Broncos defense so great, but they can't stop Buffalo, and Buffalo is not all doing all that good. So it, it, they can't stop a sucky team like Buffalo. We expect them to stop Patriots. So I want to say the, 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 the Patriots. That was that really game don't really count. People say, "Oh, uh, well, I'm trying to say Patriots versus the Broncos don't really count because everybody knew that Patriots would win that." Yeah, that's an easy game for Patriots. That was a real easy game because the Broncos defense is not that great at all. That defense is overrated. People think their defense is great. They can they, they still allow 23 points against the um, Steelers. Steelers could have scored if they got ball. I, I think it's Rochester got ball. They could have scored. My opinion. I just I just think they could have scored, man. Because I think Broncos even not all that good. You see, forty. Eli Peyton Manning wasn't. I mean. Tom Brady wasn't even having a hard time with him, man. Tom Brady, it was too easy with Tom Brady, man. Tom Brady is just a mismatch. Brown versus the um, Patriots is just a mismatch. You know, it wasn't even a real game. It just was a mismatch, man. We knew Tebow couldn't score a lot of points. Tebow's not that type of quarterback to score somebody. Tebow's the type of quarterback to win games for you, but he's not the type of quarterback to score a whole bunch of points. Yes, he, but he, uh, yes, he scored 29 points, but that was only one game. He he didn't score, you know what I mean. That was really, really big, but that was like only one freaking game that Tebow really went off crazy. Like 300 something yards. He can't do that every game. Tebow wasn't ready yet to be a quarterback like Tom Brady, Joe Montana, Aaron Rodgers, Drew Brees, Eli Manny. I can say all them quarterbacks, man. I ain't say, I'm not trying to say he got a good quarterback. He's not going to take that type of quarterback to score crazy and stay with Tom Brady. He didn't even didn't have a chance. He didn't have a chance at all. He's not a good quarterback. You know what I mean? He's not that quarterback that could do that. He's not that type of quarterback. He's not the type of quarterback to play good off and on, do good, not every game. He can't do good every game. Like Tom Brady. You know Tom Brady can go put some points on the board. He know he never let you down. He know he had more chance. He know he had we like mostly Tom Brady's defense, the worst defense in the NFL. What saved the Patriots? Was Tom Brady and I'm in, in his offense, his wide receivers in offense that saved the Patriots. Patriots defense is horrible. Tom Brady put 45 points up. Basically, the Patriots are gonna win because they gonna win, man. If you if your offense not good enough to score with Tom Brady, you not you not gonna beat Tom Brady. If Tom Brady go crazy in scoring, you are not gonna win. You are not gonna outscore Tom Brady. Yeah, I don't see that unless unless it's Aaron Rodgers. Or Drew Brees or Eli Eli Manning or maybe Alex Smith. He probably he got better now, but I don't see um no other quarterback that stayed with Tom Brady. I see Baltimore if Baltimore wanna beat Patriots, they had to play good defense. If defense doesn't play good, they gonna lose. If you play just like the Broncos play defense, they gonna lose. I don't care what nobody says, they gonna lose. I don't see Facto Scoring with Tom Brady. I may be shocked. He might go crazy scoring with Tom Brady, but I don't see that happening. I see him get, get like 29 points up, 24. That's the highest he get. But I don't see him scoring a whole bunch of points. I don't see that. Okay, I don't see that. I don't know, man. You got to tell me, man. Like I said, they, they got to play good defense, and they, 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 they got to run a lot against the Patriots. They just can't stop the run that good, so they got to run a lot. They got to run against the Patriots, slow down the game. But I can't pick all the game, all the game, give it all, pick all the hope into flat road. Trust me, you can't. The defense got to play good. Everybody, the whole team got to play with the team. The whole team got to play good. They got to That's how you stop Tom Brady. You have to put pressure on Tom Brady. 
pressure. It's not just pressure. You gotta give him time You gotta hurt Tom Brady. You gotta hit him. You gotta hit Tom Brady. You gotta play soft zone. You just need the pressure, Tom Brady. You gotta play soft zone. You can't play like you know. What I mean, press zone against Tom Brady. You gotta play soft zone. I mean, leave a guy. You got some cushion. Spy on the guy a little bit. You know what I mean? What I'm talking about. Get a guy some cushion. Then just come down, pick it off. And Tom Brady always do the ball. He getting blitz. So just play soft zone on Tom Brady. If you wanna be Tom Brady. You gotta play soft zone with him. Just watch all the games. Play soft zone. Play blitz him. Just the defense, the defense line got blitz, man. They gotta blitz time. They gotta get in time blitz. They gotta come blitzing time. They crazy, man. I mean, just play soft zone. These guys open on purpose. Just play that. I don't leave him open. I like he's open. Tom Brady wants to throw the ball to the open guy. That when you cut inside and pick it off. Just watch the Redskins game. Yes, he, he beat the Redskins, but Redskins beat themselves. Redskins had a chance to win that game. Tom Brady got lucky at the end. I'm not going to say luck, but they, they could have lost. They were lucky to Redskins. They were lucky to Redskins. They were lucky against Dallas. The Dallas defense struck at the end, but you just had no Tom Brady. That's how Tom Brady, I knew Dallas was going to lose because that's how Tom Brady is. He's the type of quarterback that you get the game, you give him too much time on the court on time, he's going to beat you. But that one thing, you got to. Like I said, you gotta play that soft zone, man. You gotta set the blitz. Give him, you gotta get Tom Brady a lot of pressure. Not just pressure. You gotta hurt Tom Brady. You gotta hit him when you when you give him pressure. You gotta hit him hard. And Tom Brady's still gonna throw the ball. Trust me, you can pick Tom Brady ball off if you get pressure in his face and hit him. And just play soft zone. And leave him open for him a little, little bit. Then give him some gap. Then leave him open. And Tom, Tom Brady throw the ball. You cut inside and just pick it off, man. And just smack it down. Because Tom Brady is a good quarterback, but you gotta scheme for Tom Brady. You gotta Confuse Tom Brady. You gotta scheme, uh, make a scheme for Tom Brady. Be ready for Tom Brady. You just, you, you people just gotta play good if they wanna beat the Patriots and stop uh, beat the Patriots. The defense gotta play good. The offense gotta score, not score a lot of points, but score. And and you know how I say score, and then take it slow. You gotta take it slow against Tom Brady. You can't expect rush and try to score a quick touchdown against Tom Brady. You can't do that. You gotta go slow and score. Take it slow, run the ball, pound the ball, keep pounding the ball, keep pounding the ball, and throw the ball and run. Run, pound, pound, do all that stuff. You gotta mix it up. You can't take all all the pressure on Phil Jackson, Phil Faster. He gonna I'm, I'm sorry to say his name right. You can't take all the pressure on Faster on 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 Faster. I can't say his name right, but you can't you just can't take all the pressure on him. You can't. You cannot put all the pressure on him. He's going to lose the game. Not what they lost. Mostly Boston will lose their game because they put so much pressure on Phil, Phil Jackson, um, Phil, Phil, Phil Faxo. When they put so much on Faxo, when they put all that pressure on him, they put the game in his hand, they won't lose. They can't put all the game in his hand. They had to, one thing I have to tell you, they had to do one thing. They got to run the ball a lot. They got to... But well, Jackson just can't go deep. He got to do short pads and do those little dump off pads and do little slant, slant pads and do this spray and wide the water shoes around. Spread them around. Spread them around. If they listen, the dough, do, the do, do, have a route that you know go short and get a, at least five yards play on each time. Or get a first down or something, man. Because he can't put all, the, put all the stuff in his hands, man. I'm just saying. The, the whole offense team got to step up, not just Joe Fasco. You had to, let me give you one thing. They had to hand the ball. They had to run, like I said. They had to run the ball, man. I know I'm treating myself, but they have to run the ball. They don't run the ball a lot. They get up to all this hand, they're going to lose. Like I said, they got to they gotta shut down Tom Brady. If they keep Tom Brady to 20 points, they might have a chance to beat him. I think Joe Fett at least get 20, 24 points or 20, maybe 27 points to get. That's the highest you go up to. If they keep Tom Brady to 17 or 20, then you can beat him. Um, probably, yeah, yeah, I think you keep to 17, you can beat the Patriots. If Tom Brady can score 17 points, they're going to lose. I think they're going to lose. Tom Brady, if Tom Brady going to score more than 17 points, they're going to lose. So, yeah, Tom Brady beat the um, Rams like that, but I think that's a different story. The Baltimore defense is better than the Rams defense. So, I think Baltimore, you need, anybody in Baltimore defense needs to step up. Reed needs to play good. I know Reed's going to have a good game. I know T. Zizzi is going to have a good game. You know, no, he's five and T. Zizzi. You know what I'm talking about. But, yeah, he, you already know he's going to have a good game. So, you know, I worry about him. I, I, I know Baltimore defense is going to step their game up. They just have to play like they played against the um, Patriots last time. 
They got to blitz Tom Brady and hurt him. Make Tom Brady throw them stupid, crazy pads. Make him throw, blitz Tom and hurt him. Make him throw pads that he don't want to throw. Make him throw it. This confuse Tom Brady. This miss your, this, this confuse him, man. This get Tom Brady all confused, man. You know, you cannot play on this game. Y'all whole defense got to step up. Y'all defense play bad. Y'all going to lose the game. Baltimore going to lose the game if they defense play bad. They going to lose. So, y'all defense need to step up, Baltimore. If y'all want to win this game, y'all defense got to play good. You know? And I got to run the ball, and Flacco got to play good. But he don't have, have to play like freaking score, throw dirty something, touch. Dirty, he don't have to throw so many balls or throw 300 something yards. He just throw 200 yards and score like two touchdowns or maybe three. That's it. Or two or three. Or just two. It's a running back to score. Just, you need to. Like I said, they need to take go take the game slow. Don't rush and score so quick. Take the game slow and score. That's what you need to do. Make sure Tom Brady get the ball in his hands all the time. Just make sure Tom Brady get the ball in his hands. Just run the whole half of the quarter down all the time. Now you got to do the Tom Brady. You got to do the Tom Brady. You got to make Tom Brady try to – you got to put pressure on Tom Brady. You have to put pressure on Tom Brady. By just taking the slow, taking the slow, running the timeout, make Tom Brady, you know what I mean. I'm just saying, you got to take a slow Tom Brady, then Tom Brady got to go to the ball and put pressure on him because he's trying to see Tom Brady trying to score points. So, what I'm trying to say is they need to put pressure on Tom Brady by blitzing crazy, man. I mean, blitz, not blitz the linebackers, it's blitz. The leave the end guy blitz in. Or the blitz the extra guy in, you know? This is hit time, but just hit him. You know? Then I put dang man, you know what I'm trying to say, man. I know I'm saying the same stuff in the video. I'm sorry if I repeat myself so many times in the video, man. I'm sorry. Dang man. But anyway, man, y'all know you you know what I mean in this video, man. The so Baltimore, if y'all wanna beat freaking Tom Brady and them, I have to play great defense. In fact we gotta step up and freaking running back gotta play good. They're not the whole team got to play good. They got to play a team game to win. Team effort. That's how you will beat Patriots. So everybody got to do their job. Everybody got to do their job. Trust me. Patriots defense not all that good, I think. I think Flack got a chance to score a lot of points on them if he played good. I need mean, Patriots defense already. They defense not all that good. So, I'm not saying because he's not that good, but I think, I, I think Patriots is all that good. So that blocker got to block back. Well, give him time. Give him time, man. Everybody got to do their job. Everybody got to do their job, okay? That's how Baltimore going to beat Patriots. That's, why, that's how I think they're going to win, man. Uh, I, I think that Baltimore going to beat Patriots. That's my opinion. I think Patriots, Baltimore are not scared of Tom Brady. The Broncos were scared of Tom Brady. Freaking Baltimore is not scared of Tom Brady. They're not going to do what they did on, on Broncos. Broncos... Didn't tell you about it. Broncos wasn't all that good. Patriots, it was a mixed match. Patriots versus Broncos. Broncos didn't have a chance to beat the Patriots. This Patriots is too good for them. But now, this, now it's even now. The, the Baltimore, the Baltimore is a way better team. They have way better defense than the than the um, than the Broncos. The Baltimore are gonna gonna win this game, people. I know my, my picks was wrong last year. I only had one good pick. That was the Patriots game. I think the Patriots gonna beat the Broncos. I was way off the rest of the picks. But I was shocked about the Green Bay and the Giants. But I knew Giants had a chance to win that game. I knew Giants had a chance. I knew Giants meet up with the Green Bay again. They're gonna beat them. But I ain't know it really gonna happen. But you know, man. But anyway, man. I ain't, I, ain't, I hope this game be good, man. I can't wait for the, the, the game this Sunday. Yeah, I think. I, I told y'all people, I'm telling y'all people, all the people that said, oh, Patriots bandwagon, he saying Tom Brady, you know, they don't, because the reason why people are saying that um, Baltimore don't have a chance because the Flacco, they got Flacco as a quarterback, he, he can't score. You got, you got to score out of place to beat Tom Brady. No, you don't got to score out of place to beat Tom Brady. Just watch the, just watch the, um, the Giants game. The Giants versus the Patriots in the Super Bowl. Giants didn't score not a lot of points. I think Giants only scored 17 points. Yeah, I think they only scored 17 it was it was fourteen to seventeen. The Giants scored last touchdown at the end in seventeen fourteen. The last game at the end, it was seventeen fourteen. The Super Bowl Giants won by, I think, three points. Yeah. 
Yeah, I think Giants, how many points Giants won by? Three points, I think? Uh-huh. Yeah, they won by three points, didn't they? Yeah, they won by three points. The Patriots needed a field goal range, I think. Or did they need a touchdown? I'm oh, wrong. How much points did um, Patriots have scored? Yeah, Patriots have 14. I think Patriots have 14, and the Giants have 17. I think so, I'm wrong. Yeah, 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 that's what the score was. Yeah, Giants scored again. Giants scored at the end. The Patriots have to win this win. Then Giants and what's next score at the end? Yeah, um, yeah, that was right. Yeah, I was right. That's not wrong people. Tell me I'm wrong people, but just watch the Patriots versus Giants game. Tom Brady did not score that much points. And he still, and, um, and they, I mean, the Giants did not score that much points on the Patriots, and, and the Giants still beat them. Their defense played good. The Baltimore got played just like the Giants played. They defense got step, the defense end got stepped, but they got to give Tom Brady a lot of pressure and give him time to get, even look at nobody. I mean, don't get one second. You get Tom Brady too much time. You get Tom Brady one second, and it's over. I mean, I mean maybe you just if you get one second, it's over. Or it's, you got to blitz Tom Brady. You get no time at all. You got to blitz Tom Brady like the Giants. The Giants, Tom Brady had no time in the Giants. They were blitzing Tom Brady crazy. And put Giants were playing soft zone defense, playing all type of defense, you know, that's what I was saying, man. People don't understand that, man. People do not understand that. You know? You got to play just like the Giants, man, if you want to win. I mean, if you want to, I mean, you got I mean, Baltimore got to play just like the Giants if they want to beat the Patriots. They got to play just like Giants playing the Super Bowl, man. They got to play just like that. People keep saying because they have on different weapons, but they have Randy Moss all the good players on their team. But people say they got more weapons now. Patriots got way more weapons. That don't mean nothing, man. They're not that. You gotta get a guy pressure. The Aaron Rodgers don't have so many weapons. It just Giants were getting Aaron Rodgers so much pressure. He had no time to look around. You saw open that guy was, and it wasn't because you saw open that guy was, and Rodgers can't get the ball off in time because all that pressure, man. All that freaking pressure. That's what they got to do to beat Tom Brady. They got to get Tom Brady pressure. They got to confuse Tom Brady. They got to do all that stuff with the Giants did in their game. That's how Baltimore going to beat them. I hope the Baltimore people watching this video, I hope somebody screen this video and show the Baltimore people and tell me how you need to beat what's This is going to look at the last, Baltimore is going to look at the last game to face Tom Brady. They're going to look at the Giants game. Look at all the games that Tom Brady had a hard time in. That's the games you got to look at. That's the games you got to look at, man. Okay, people, I, I, I love Tom Brady, man. I believe Tom Brady, catch him. Tom Brady could beat the Baltimore, but I don't know. I don't see Tom Brady beat the Baltimore. I, 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 I'm saying Baltimore defense is way better than the Broncos. Tom Brady always had a hard time with Baltimore. If Tom Brady beat the Baltimore, I will. I think Tom Brady's going to win the Super Bowl. If he beat Baltimore go to the Super Bowl, I think Tom Brady's going to win the Super Bowl if he goes to the Super Bowl. So, um, but it's not, but if I did, if I, did, I think Baltimore will win the Super Bowl. If Baltimore will win the Super Bowl. Baltimore will win the Super Bowl. They're gonna win the Super Bowl. So I think Baltimore will win the Super Bowl. They win the Super Bowl. I think it's gonna be AFC teams. All the AFC teams win the Super Bowl. So anyway, man, my pick is Baltimore. I don't know the score gonna be. I'll tell you the score later because I gotta, I gotta do research first. Okay, our peace out, peoples. But then again, I see the game being a low scoring game. I see time. I see time Brady only having. 17, only scored 17 points. I see that. And I see him, Baltimore, scoring 28. 28 to 17. That's the score going to be. That's the score going to be. People need that shot, but it might be wrong. But I, don't, I might change my score later on. Anyway, people, peace out. Have a nice day. Baltimore going to win. Peace out, people. Bye.